A gloomy gray day in Calgary didn't stop the Avengers from dropping in. You look like you've been working out, getting ready for the poll. Uh, tell me what your preparation looks like. Uh, I did like three push-ups, oh. uh, eight an omelet. Is this going to be your PR for pulling? No, no, no. you got to put like two or three more planes oh. on there for, for PR. Captain Calgary, and not Batman, but Bowman, teaming up for their biggest challenge yet. We're pulling a WestJet Q400, weighs 67,000 pounds, and teams of 10 um, are going to give it a go in the rain. But the real superheroes are who these teams are pulling for. The Hope for Hall fundraising for patients who can't afford travel or accommodations to access the health care they deserve. It's a mission that strikes a personal chord with John Collins. My daughter was born with congenital scoliosis. She's well, but she will need a surgery when she's five years old. I found Hope Baird for a job posting. I was holding my then infant daughter, uh, and, and the reality of her journey and the reality of our good fortune to get her the care that she needs without question hit me. While Collins does have access to a major hospital only 90 minutes from his front door, thousands of Canadians do not. You know, there's millions of Canadians who live in rural, remote, and underserved communities. Millions. And that's where the idea to pull a commercial jet comes into play. The teams of 10 challenged with not only pulling the 107-foot aircraft, but doing so 100 meters as fast as they can. I guess if they think that's hard, uh, we try to symbolize a patient journey and the distance they have to go to care, which is a lot harder in our world. All proceeds from Thursday's event go to Hope Air, raising not just money, but hope for those who need it the most. You're actually making dreams come true for people who only have one wish, and that's that they get well. Joel Tomlinson, Global News.